But now you know every Monday at 6 o'clock, our Walt Grayson has a story about <laughs> something a little different, and today is no different. That's right. Last Monday it was waterfalls, and today, Walt, you're going right across the road from them, right? Well, yeah, why waste gasoline if there's a perfectly good story just right across the road? Besides that, this is the perfect story for a windy, blustery, rainy day. Uh, it's about a store that dates back to the mid-1800s, and not only is it old, it may be haunted. The Clark Creek Waterfalls are an oddity for Mississippi. Now, if you ever visit the waterfalls, then you'll want to stop here first. This is the Pond Store. That's right before you get there. You'll want to stock up on water and a snack before tackling the falls. Besides, the store is fascinating. And Mr. Lindquitz had escaped from Russia during the Bolshevik Revolution. He'd been educated by the Russian government. And so he was supposed to go into the Russian army and serve and all of these things. But he had escaped. Well, when Mr. Lemkowitz came to America, he ended up as the proprietor of Pond Store. And Liz Chafin's parents went to work for him in the 1920s. And my mother and dad lived with Mr. Lemkowitz and his family at first. And so when Mr. Lemkowitz died, my dad bought the place, the business, from the Lemkowitz. Mr. Lemkowitz told Liz's parents that if it were permitted after he died, he might drop back in on the Pond Store from time to time to check on things. And there are those who say he has. Yes, that, and, and I've had several people that have seen him. I've never seen him. I had a young man in here, he was working with the electric company, and he was getting something to drink, and he comes to the front and he says, do you have a ghost? Said, well, you know, Mr. Lindquitz. He says, I just saw him. He says, I turned around, there he was. And then, he, you know, and so it's been, People like that say they have seen him. And then I've had a couple that spent the night here, and the, the next morning he, she said that this elderly man was standing at the foot of her bed last night. And I said, well, if he comes back tonight, tell him to come to my room, because I've never met him. The interesting things you can see out in the country, and maybe more interesting, the things you don't see. Just so you know, Pond Store is not open right now because of COVID. Well, for that matter, neither are the waterfalls. So when the state opens the waterfalls, though, Liz says they'll open Pond Store again. I'm Walt Grayson.